and welcome to another video. It's officially autumn and I am ready for it. In my city, there are several fall festivals that take place throughout the season. So in this video, I'm making a fall festival outfit. It's kind of folky, little house on the prairie meets Instagram hobbits kind of vibe. It basically consists of a midi length skirt and a folky apron. The skirt was super simple, just two large rectangles, some pockets and elastic. I started by attaching the pockets to the skirt pieces. Then, I attached the skirt pieces, making sure to go around the pockets. Next, I folded over the waistband twice to make a tube for the elastic to go inside. The supervisor stopped in. I think this is the highest approval rating I've ever gotten. I used my pimple popper to pull the elastic through the waistband. Then connected the ends and sewed the tube shut. Finally, I did a rolled hem on the bottom skirt was done. It turned out cute, but it's giving me major Sunday school teacher vibes. The apron was also pretty simple. It's basically just a bunch of variously sized rectangles. I drafted it using my own measurements, which I took several times because I tend to be a measure twice, cut twice kind of person. Here are the pattern pieces I created. I cut them out and it was time to assemble. First, I sewed the straps, flipped them inside out, and ironed them flat. Then I made loops for the waistband. I sandwiched the straps between the bodice and lining, then flipped it right side out, top stitched the lining, and hemmed the sides. I sandwiched the waistband and the bodice together and attached them. I hemmed the top edge of the skirt pockets and attached them to the skirt. I hemmed the skirt sides. Then I gathered the skirt, again sandwiching it between the waistband layers to attach them. I tucked the loops into the end of the waistband and sewed it shut. I hemmed the sides and bottom of the ruffle, then gathered it with a one inch hem at the top. I attached the ruffle along the hem, then it was done. It turned out exactly how I pictured. And I can really see myself hanging out with Mary and Pippin or Anne Shirley. Back when that dancing news anchor meme was popular, I bought this pumpkin head so I could dress up as that news anchor for Halloween. And I thought this was a good chance to give it a second life. Keep an eye out for my other autumn content coming up, and we'll see you in the next one.